Hey, it's Jake. Ever wondered if you can remove a blacklisted IMEI from your phone? Maybe you've come across some shady services or software claiming to fix it, but let's be real. They're either sketchy, expensive, or just plain don't work. Today, I'm going to show you multiple ways to remove that bad ESN from any device. iOS, Android, you name it. And the best part? These methods are safe, free, and guaranteed to work. Let's dive in. Just a quick heads up. This is for device owners who've forgotten their access info. We don't support bypassing security on stolen devices. Follow the law and respect others. Our video plays nice with YouTube's rules and community guidelines. Now let's get going. All right, onto the services that can help you out. You might have heard about a couple of places like ESN Doctor, Safe Unlocks, and Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app. Now these aren't your typical run-of-the-mill solutions. They're really something. But hey, I'm not saying this to sell them to you. My goal here is to educate and help you find your way out of a sticky situation. So let's dive a bit deeper into what they offer. First up, we've got ESN Doctor. These guys are pretty solid when it comes to removing blacklists. They've got some serious skills, and you can trust them to do the job. Then there's Safe Unlocks, another top-notch team that knows their stuff. They're all about getting you back on track with minimum fuss. Last but not least, we've got Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app. This isn't just a service, it's a whole AI system designed to help you unlock your device. I mean, talk about high-tech, right? These services are really the front-runners when it comes to sorting out blacklisted devices. But remember, we're just going through the options here. Soon I'm going to show you how to use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. So stick around, we're just getting warmed up. Now here's something important to bear in mind. These unlock services typically work best in first world countries. Got a problem accessing them or just don't want to utilize these services? Don't worry, we've got you covered. Every week we offer 250 unlocks completely free of charge to our viewers. Yes, you heard that right. 250 unlocks up for grabs, and it's super easy to join in. First, make sure you hit that like button on this video. Then click subscribe, so you're always in the loop with our latest tips and tricks. Finally, drop a comment below with your phone model, for example, a Samsung S9, followed by your IMEI and your country. As soon as you do these steps, you're automatically entered into our weekly draw, with a chance to get your device unlocked for free. Now, how cool is that? So get commenting and good luck. Let's dive into how you use the AI unlocking tool at unlockhere.com to remove the blacklist on your IMEI. First, pop open your browser, either on your phone or your computer, and type in unlockhere.com. This will get you to our official AI unlocking website. You'll see our AI tool, Nifty, right there on the home page. Scroll down just a tad and pick Fix IMEI Blacklist, which is what we're going for here. Now, it's just a matter of following the prompts on the app. Start by choosing your device's brand. The app is designed to work with all big and medium-sized brands, so you should find yours there. Click Next once you've made your selection. Next, the app will need your device's IMEI or serial number. Not sure where to find that? We've got a tutorial right on the app, or you can just go to your phone's dial and press star hashtag 06 hashtag. That'll pull up your device's info, including the IMEI number. Don't forget to fill out your contact info, including your name and email. Make sure you read and agree to the app's terms and conditions. If you're not sure about anything, check out the resources provided. Once that's done, your unlock request will be sent off. You'll get an email confirming this in about 5 to 15 minutes. Don't see it? Check your spam or promotion folder. To finalize your order, copy the verification code from the email and click Confirm My Order on the website. Paste in the code and complete the CAPTCHA. After that, just hit the Validate Info and Start Unlock button. And that's it, you're done. Nifty will take over and wrap up the unlocking process. Just pop in a compatible SIM card and restart your device. As demonstrated, the IMEI unlock method proves to be highly effective, not only for the Samsung S9, but also for a wide range of devices. You can go ahead and give it a try with confidence, and feel free to inspect your device to ensure everything is running smoothly. If anything trips you up along the way, don't hesitate to chat with live support. They're ready and waiting to help you out. All right, guys, here are some more alternative ways to remove a carrier blacklist on your device. As always, we're focusing on clear and legit methods here. Nothing shady. One of the easiest ways is to contact the carrier that blacklisted your device. Talk to them and explain your situation. In most cases, if you've got a legitimate reason and provide proof of ownership, they can simply remove the blacklist. This might sound too simple to be true, but sometimes, Carriers blacklist devices because bills haven't been paid. So, 
pay up any outstanding bills, and you should be all clear. Finally, I know it can sound a bit technical, but trust me, it's simpler than it seems. There are a bunch of third-party services like Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app, Safe Unlocks, and ES and Doctor that can handle this for you. But remember, always go for reputed services to avoid any scams or foul play, so these are some legit ways to remove a carrier blacklist. I hope this was helpful, and remember, if you've got any questions, I'm here to help. Stay tuned for more helpful tips to navigate the tricky world of device unlocking.